Hey guys, so Apple just released a new update to Logic Pro 10. And it is a very small update, but one thing that they finally did here is to let the user relocate the sound library that comes with Logic. So as soon as you download Logic Pro 10 from the App Store, there will be a huge sound library that is around 60, 70 gigabytes in size. And Logic always put that huge sound library by default on your uh, internal hard drive. And nowadays we have uh, SSD drives with 256 gigabytes or 512 gigabytes, and they are very, very pricey. So having all that disk space taking up on your internal hard drive is not really a good solution. So what I always did with previous versions of Logic was to take my sound library and you could do it with a trick that sometimes did work and sometimes did not work. And that was to uh, create something called Simlink to an external hard drive and then copy the sound libraries onto your external hard drive. But now with this update and it's version 10.4.2. So as soon as you have it updated to this version or later, then you will have this, uh, this option. So what you do here, you go to Logic Pro 10 then to sound library. And now we have a new thing here called relocate sound library. So if you go here, uh, it will calculate the, the size of the sound library and it says, yeah, it's around 70 gigabytes. So as you can see here, my external hard drive is connected, it's a less C hard drive. And I have uh, 700 gigs of free space here. So the only thing you need to do now is to just select the hard drive, the external hard drive that you have connected to your computer, and then go to relocate. And now it, would, it will automatically uh, move all of the sounds that comes with Logic to my external hard drive. So now as soon as I start Logic Pro 10 without my external hard drive connected to the computer, then I won't see the sounds. But as soon as I connect my hard drive and just restart Logic Pro 10, then I will see all of the sounds that comes with uh, the sound library. So this is a very nice solution and uh, they finally did this for, and it has been missing for so many years now. Um, that huge sound library that is very good. Uh, I mean, Apple's sound library that, that Logic Pro 10 comes with for free uh, is amazing. I mean, the sounds are so high quality and um, you can use them freely throughout your projects. Uh, so, yeah, and I always had them on my internal hard drive and that, that huge space, 70 gigabytes. So I don't want the space to take it up on my hard drive and always put that on an external hard drive, then created that little simlink trick that did not work. Uh, or that did work for some time and then stopped working for some reason and it was a complete mess so this is very nice relocate sound library you can find it on logic pro 10 sound library and relocate sound library all right guys so uh, i will see you in the next lecture